Two undefeated teams came to battle in the snow tonight and Rutgers came out on top. Number seven Rutgers defeated number 14 Stony Brook 17 to four. What you're seeing is that Rutgers is seriously uh, a contender. The way we prepare during the week, how focused and mature we are, you know, gives us the opportunity to play you know, very good lacrosse through 60 minutes. That's the way a top 10 program should handle themselves at home. So uh, proud of them. They uh, responded to the task. They certainly played extremely well tonight. Overall, we were, we were pretty lights out. JoJo uh, crushed it on the faceoffs. Defense, defense was amazing, unstoppable. And uh, offense, we were just clicking early and often, and uh, we just ran with it. So super excited about tonight. The defense played outstanding. It's, uh, it's what we work on all week. At the X today, I got a lot of help from my wings, takeaways and pushing up the field to our uh, rope unit. I thought they did a great job, and then pushing transition with our attack, I thought we executed well. I think our defense has been lights out. I mean, they didn't sniff it tonight. So there's a top 15 team, and we were sharp, we were focused, we knew our responsibilities, and uh, we played extremely well. I think it's, it says that we came a long way. Uh, we established it last year, and you know a lot of people doubted us coming to this season, but uh, I think that it sets a milestone here that we are a Big Ten program and we are going to be the best. It's been improving every year and we're really excited about it. Got to carry this over into Princeton on Tuesday night. This Rutgers team is quickly turning heads with their continued success. It says a lot about the lacrosse culture here on the banks. Catch them defend their turf at High Point Solutions Stadium against Princeton on Tuesday, March 14th at 7 p.m. Reporting for Our Vision, I'm Samantha York.